I bring in all wishes and greetings from Speed Medical Institute on behalf of all the faculty members and Speed Thank Management you. team to Dr. Shyash Niranjan Ambekar. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Excellent. Congratulations to you. Thank you, sir. So, can we know a little background of yours from where you started from and where you are till today? Uh, yes, sir. I actually, I, my native place is in Pune, Maharashtra. I was born and brought up there. Yeah. Then uh, I did my MBBS from BJ Government Medical College, Pune. Uh, then MD from uh, Saint GS Medical College uh, and KM Hospital Mumbai, and then uh, now I just gave my uh, NEET SS exam. After so when did you finish your exam? Uh, final sir, year. I final year. Uh, MD PG. exam I uh, finished this year itself in uh, June. Okay, June. So July announcement of NEET SS came. Then you started your preparation. Is it right, or uh, you started yeah. before exam? Yeah. No, I started sir, after I completed my PG after. Okay. So can you uh, uh, share, I mean, how you joined Speed? I mean, who recommended you? I mean, how you come across uh, Speed? Uh, yeah, uh, actually, a few of my seniors had uh, subscribed speed, uh, speed in, uh, for a few of my seniors from KM. Uh, so um, I, there were quite a few platforms, but uh, actually when I... Uh, saw one of my batchmates using it. I found that the interface was very good, and uh, I think I had seen your video. One you had uh, made a video on uh, how Speed was going to incorporate the updates from the twenty-first edition of Harrison, and I think only uh, Speed was going going to uh, include all the latest updates from twenty-first uh, edition edition uh, of Harrison's in the uh, in their videos. So I think that is when I decided that I felt that now since uh, this is my, uh, I have not watched uh, videos before or I am not as such prepared for neat SS before and this is my first attempt. So I felt that why not start with uh, uh, Harrison's 21st edition itself and then that would be better. That is what I felt. Okay. So, so anyway, 20th is gone. 21st is now out in April. Now exam is postponed for three months. Let us do the first preparation with 21st itself. Yes, sir. Let us try our level best. Whatever comes is okay. Or let us see next year. But this year itself, it got everything cleared. Yes, sir. <laughs> great, great. So what did you do for this 45 days? I mean, during uh, the preparation, how many hours you spent? What all you did? Can you tell us? Uh, sir, what I did is that I tried to go through the uh, speed videos, uh, whatever... Uh, I, I think I didn't see all the videos from each subject, but whatever I felt that uh, I had read, but they were uh, slightly on the weaker side. So whatever I had read from Harrison's or from what books and, but I was not very sure, uh, clear about certain concepts. So I definitely made a point to see those videos. So I uh, saw like uh, maybe 50, 60% uh, 50, of videos from each subject. And then I tried to, you know, go through the presentations or I made made a few notes myself as well. So I found that all the videos were really helpful. But even like um, Dr. Dheeraj sir from Gastro, his videos were also very, um, very, very useful. I think all the questions were from the exam were also from his videos. So I think from all for all faculty members, not just uh, his videos, but uh, so... I think all the videos were great and uh, what I think the videos, uh, the, the main advantage of those videos was that once you read, you don't sometimes realize what to focus on uh, when you read, like what question can be asked from that following, from that paragraph or from the table. So like most of the faculty members, uh, actually they used to not just discuss the tables, but uh, they used to, you know, actually point out that which question from the table can actually be asked. So. Uh, it was a quick recap also. So, uh, you know what exactly to expect in the exam. So, I think that was a great, uh, uh, the videos were really helpful. And um, there was a high yield series on 21st edition of uh, yes, Harrison I itself. I was coming to that. So, uh, that was also a very uh, great idea because uh, like we were, uh, from my batch, uh, almost everyone didn't have like for six months or uh, four or five months to prepare or so we had a time crunch so in that uh, it was not possible to maybe go through exhaustive videos of each subject or maybe read the whole book uh, from cover to cover 
so i found that uh, uh, the high yield series was very good especially in the last month or last month uh, it was very helpful and uh, it covered most of the points i i should say that definitely that was a great uh, initiative and i think that like uh, it the few of the faculty members discussed only questions so it was a kind of a question answer session as well as a uh, uh, lecture series so it was a great uh, addition uh, because i did an interview almost close to 60 uh, 60 to 70 interviews on medical group yes and, uh, i mean most of them were mentioning this last high yield series of 21st edition of harrison they said this is what in 20 uh, 20th and this is a change in 21 and yes, and those sir. areas of 50% we could see in the question paper yes sir definitely they uh, the and the advantage was that uh, you could go through the since the high yield lectures were like for from each subject there were only two three lectures you could go through them really uh, in a short span so that was i think the main advantage of those because then you could whatever notes like suppose i, I had made few notes of my own or Uh, so i could read those notes then or maybe few tables charts whatever i felt were most important and then i could still have time to go through a, through the lectures because they were like concise and uh, it was not too they were not too lengthy so I, you could actually review them in a short period of time so they, they were a great addition okay. no where did you give all the grand test also I mean did you uh, I mean uh, gave uh, a model test I, i gave tests sir they were also helpful uh i didn't give too many grand tests actually but i gave uh, subject wise tests and topic wise tests so i found them very useful and uh, plus the added option of bookmarking the questions it's a uh, great option so you can review the bookmark questions again and uh, you can uh, so you can focus on what areas you are weak in so i think that they were uh, great uh, but uh, i mean what i feel is Uh, you have uh, had a strong determination and uh, uh, perseverance and doability in your mind and i think that has taken you to this extended level of scoring rank number 2 uh, in dm medical group uh, though the time span was short and you were uh, mentally prepared okay this is what i want to do and this is how we need to take about things and uh, that uh, judgment that is very important the decision uh, what to do in uh, the given time that is a very important decision for the success of uh, uh, any exam yes. and i appreciate the decision that you have taken and to read how to read and what to read and how it plays effectively the time management is great yes. <laughs> so <clears throat> what next what is your interest in dm uh, superficiality which specialty that you are interested in sir uh, i want to take up nephrology actually okay. there are two three reasons uh, one is uh, that uh, i always found nephrology especially in md i found it to be an interesting subject that like it encompasses like we have opd patients in patient critical care so everywhere it is required uh, then uh, it's very active branch and i think uh, quite you can save a, quite a lot of lives with uh, by being i mean for any subject that is true but especially for nephrology if you can make a lot of difference and uh, so uh, that was that is one reason the other thing is that i found that certain aspects of nephrology are very close to medicine itself so not all but maybe few, definitely certain aspects so i found that uh, since i already uh, I, i liked uh, doing md uh, uh, like i was interested in medicine so i felt that nephrology uh, was uh, somewhat similar and maybe an extension so that was another reason and one more reason being that my father himself is a nephrologist wow. uh, <laughs> great now uh, what, what is his name which place uh, is uh, practicing sir uh, he is practicing in pune uh, dr niranjan ambika great convey my regards to him i think he'll be a happy man today yes sir <laughs> you have you have made him very proud and mm-hmm. uh, he will definitely feel uh, uh, very nice about your performance yes, and and we are also equally proud of you and we are very happy that uh, you have made it and uh, and once again i wish you all the best and all the success as a great nephrologist in years to come thank you sir and i'm i'm sure that speed app also and your team is very good has been very helpful and i think even more people will utilize that and i think the whatever 
in the end whatever this knowledge that you are sharing through your platform i think that will help so many not just for the entrances but in general to learn medicine and to you know uh, help in the uh, future practice also whatever the information and the knowledge which they gain so i think that's a great uh, thank you for a very encouraging words doctor because we always believe in almost uh, constant renewals that means update on daily basis uh, i mean we need to carry on because it is changing on daily basis uh, things yes. are happening on uh, already happened months back but still yes. it to be updated in our system so that has to get renewed and we have a lot of things to renew that's why we believe in things actually uh, so thanks for your encouragement and support thank you sir thank you doctor all the best thank yes. you thank you